Well, that happened. And unfortunately, Chitori has Chitori gave her life in order to save Junpei's. But we can't really dwell on that right now. We need to keep on moving. And today, there's really one thing I really feel like doing, so I'm just gonna run and take care of that. But in order to take care of that, I need to go and get the persona I got last time because in getting back here, and that is not where I needed to go. As I was saying, in redoing what I messed up, I didn't go back to the mall and get that persona. I'm just gonna head over here. But yes, Chidori, in her dying breath, tells Junpei that she loves her. I must say, the first time I ever saw that part, it broke my heart. It really did, and it still does to this day, honestly. Oh, excuse me. We do have Nadini now, so let us leave. Being completely honest, I forgot that the event happened as soon as it does. I was expecting a few more days before that to happen. And there's not really much that can be done for the time being. And I believe the Watodai Station is where I want to go. Yeah, it's the right place. Names. Do I, can I read them? It's okay, Ken. I think a lot of us are worried about Junpei. 
But at this point, there's really not, not much we can do for him. Just we have to wait. Even if I don't like you, Ken, I can understand you being worried about him. You little piece of shit. <laughs> Well, I didn't. I forgot that it was just a random ass time skip for those four days. <sighs> well, now let us just go to sleep. Ending for the day. I don't think I have an Emperor's Persona on me. But I don't think I have made many, if any, Emperor's Persona. I have an Emperor's Persona on me. That is so convenient. That's so like really convenient. <laughs> Because tonight, we're headed to the top of the suitor.
cheer up, Junpei. Yeah. So what do you want? This came for you. It's from the hospital. That's... They were going through her items when they found that. I know I have to snap out of this, but it's just so hard. Hey, Junpei, can I take a look? You wouldn't be able to understand her drawings anyways. Wait, is this... Wow, it's really good. This is amazing. Who wouldn't be able to understand it? Uh huh? Is this? It's a detailed portrait of Junpei san. Chidori. <laughs> Telling me to stop moping around. She must be looking out for you. <sighs> I promised to fight to get rid of the dark hour. And I'm sorry for all the times I snapped at you. It still bothers me a little. But I want you to know that I'm counting on your abilities. I'm not gonna lie, that was actually really touching. I see, didn't see that book and everything. But now, might as, not, might as well not waste any time and just go straight to sleep. Alright, so since it's Sunday, I am going to go hang out at, with Akinari again. Just because, honestly, if you have nothing to do with Sundays, you really should just go hang out with Akinari, especially since that's the only day you can really hang out with him. Okay, I may need to get a lover's persona sometime in the near future, but it's not very important.
Oh, hey! Okay, so... Really don't have much to do right now. What is it? It's November 29th. We finished every quest that needed to be done at this point, so I'm just gonna head back to the world. Eventually, we will have to go back into Tartarus because I'm pretty sure more Lizard's requests will open up. But that's probably something I'm gonna do off camera purely for the fact that the Lizard's requests that open up won't be because the new area of Tartarus is open. It's literally gonna be for the second part of the Tartarus area that I've already explored. He's fast travel. Yeah. But since we are blah, blah, blah. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore right now. I just had like a mental lapse and just things were just coming out of my mouth. <laughs> um, but no, and back to me actually focusing on what I'm doing. We're gonna be heading hanging out with Mom Mama. God, I don't know why I can never say this name. And since we have Nadi, we should be good. So let's hang out with the EM. You know, I'm here a lot, but I hardly ever run into you. Strange, huh? Oh well, I'm out of here. See you later. Was that Ryoji-san? Yeah, he said he was going home. What was he doing here? He's been coming here a lot ever since he started hanging around with Junpei. But visitors aren't allowed here. Yeah, but Mitsuro Senpai said it's okay during the day. I don't think we need to worry about Ryoji kun. He's dangerous. Who? Ryoji kun? Come to think of it, he was hitting on Mitsuru Senpai the first time he met her. He was? <laughs> but having him around has really cheered up Junpei kun. 
Well, it's not like moping around's gonna bring her back. That's true. I envy you, Junpei. I'm a machine, so I cannot understand how it feels to live. But you don't seem that different. However, it is more accurate to say that I am functioning as opposed to living. There are times when I malfunction, but I can always be repaired. So if we were all like you, we wouldn't have to worry about dying. Uh, sorry. Hey, I don't have time to talk. I seriously gotta go study. Hey, shouldn't you guys be studying too? I heard math's gonna be a killer. You wait until now to tell us that? Well, I guess we should call it a night then. I should not possess the gift of life. A living weapon is difficult to operate. However, I believe I understand the concept of loss. Should you ever be harmed, I... I'll try not to. You are very special to me. I do not know why, but I always want to be by your side. I want to protect you. I apologize for interrupting you. I will leave you to your studies. Good night. Ryoji Mojisuki is dangerous. What is this uneasiness? I am a machine. I cannot die, so they won't have to grieve for me. I must do something. I don't want them to suffer anymore. Well, everyone's just done bounce. Oh, look, there's Ken. Nobody cares about you. So I'm just gonna go back to the room. Not really anything else to do today. <sighs> Hello? It's me. I'm sorry for calling so late. As for what to do with the new arrival, I would like to ask that you perform a full autopsy. If we find any distinguishing features, we may be able to locate her family and... I can't shake my suspicion that the Kirijo group is tied to Strega in some way. Because of this, I think it would be disrespectful to the deceased to cover up her death. I will, of course, take full responsibility. Huh? What did you say? Transmogrified? Y you mean the corpse? But judging by the post-mortem, we were certain she was... Understood. I'm sorry, but this must be kept strictly confidential until we know more. If there are any other changes... Yes, absolutely. Well then. What's going on? Mm. We'll have to wait and see what happens for now.